All right, let's talk about uh, receivers that the Detroit Lions could trade for. I guess you call this part two. We did the emergency receivers yesterday. Check out Detroit Lions Talk playlist. Share the video. Thumbs up the video. Appreciate everybody for supporting the channel. You can support the channel by financially donating Cash App, CJ Good 313, Venmo, CJ Good 313, PayPal link. Or you can just, best way to donate, thumbs up, share the video, subscribe to the channel. Check out Detroit Lions Talk playlist. Share the video. And like I said before, only receivers I'm keeping is Cephas, Williams, and, um, well, the ones I want to keep, Cephas Williams and Amari Rossi Brown, all right? Um, Brashad Pyramid, Tom Kennedy, all them, Victor Bowe, fuck them, they can leave. I don't want them, all right? Geronimo Allison, he trash, all right? Brashad Pyramid, he can't catch. But, like I said, I'll keep three, and I'll try to trade for some other, and some good names out there that we talked about in the past that I forgot about, we talked about in the now, all right? And you got a guy like DJ Shark, which he coming off an injury. I forget what the injury was. And I think, you know, he could have been a Pro Bowl caliber receiver, but he just really ain't never had no quarterback in Jacksonville that gave him the ball. He out of LSU. And I really think, I really think he he is a, uh, I think he, he is a fantastic receiver. And right, I just don't think he get the opportunities in, like I said before. The Lions don't have too many guys. The two, Brown and Cephas, they play on, they more inside receivers, you know. Williams, they only out receiver, but you forget Williams has got out, I think he got like a groin injury, yep. So he got an injury. So like I said before, you're talking about DJ Shark, he's, hold on, I think he coming, I forget what type of injury he coming off of. Uh, Darnell, DeMont, Shark Jr. That's what you get. Uh, yeah, the bro, hold on. He said a broken finger. Let's see what it was. Let's see what it was. Yeah, sure. So let's see. Sorry. Uh, let's see what he did last year. So he, um, he, okay, he played last year. My bad, he did. Played 13 to 12 games. So like I said, he had a finger. He has 53 receptions, 706 yards, 5 TDs. So, like I said, he's lucky, fairly young. What is he, like 26? 24 years old. So, he turned 25 September 23rd, right when the season starts. So, I mean, you got a guy right there who's 6'4", give you a big frame. And he's productive. You know, he's productive for uh for the opportunities that he getting. DJ Shark, man, may only cost you. A, you could build your receiving court through, through trades. He might be a guy that just might get cut. Thousand yard receiver in 2019, eight touchdowns in 17. He missed, he missed two, uh, three games. Well, you know, so like I said before, you got a guy who uh, only received 93 targets last year. When he received 118, he went over a thousand yards. So six four, you know, athletic receiver. There you go, right there, man. And he ran a four three four. So shit, you might as well go out six four four three four. You know, you put him right out there. You, and then also, you can't trust Tyrell Williams. He already injured. He oh, he's twenty nine years old. He already injured. You know, you talking about. And then you go into a guy like Michael Gallup, a guy that might they might not be able to pay, and um, you know, should get traded. Honestly, man, he another dude that that bring electricity on the outside. He ran a four five one, but he played for, he played faster than that. And what Michael Gallup get, he give you somebody that's going to stretch the field. 6'1", 25 years old, just turned 25 years old. And he going to get vertical. He going to take the top off. That's what they want to do. You can easily, you know, trade, you know, trade a future fourth or fifth. Or, like I said before, Cowboys need defense. You got Deshaun Hand. You got Jeff Okuda. You got some other guys that can help you. They need defense. Or you give them picks for Michael Gallup. And Michael Gallup, somebody that, that can be a really, really good number two. Very electric guy, and he's going to stretch the field. So right then and there, you can get DJ Shark for a six-round pick. You can get Gallup for a fourth or fifth-round pick. Or you can get a future fourth or fifth-round pick in the next draft, and you can get some players up for him. Some defensive players, I mean, but I mean for, for Gallup, it's another good name right there, okay? Then you talk about somebody who, who and you're talking about Brandon Cooks, another guy. He's another guy that Jared Goff had uh, one of some of his best seasons with Brandon Cooks. And you get him for nothing from Houston. 
All the all these are, are, are value picks. You know how to spend the first, second, and third on most of these guys. You shouldn't have to. And um in 2018, he was with the Rams and he played all 16 games. And I think that might have been a Super Bowl year. What I say? 2016, 18, my bad. 2018, they went to the Super Bowl that year, I believe. And Jared Goff threw for 32 touchdowns and 12 interceptions. That's his best. That's his best year. Highest completion rate, highest yard, highest yards thrown, highest touchdowns. You know, and third fewest interceptions. So, like I said before, you, you mean, you know, with Brandon Cooks, you know, he, he another guy's gonna take the top off the field. 27 years old, 28, still fairly young, and um. Like I said before, there's some great options out there. Cooks is another dude that can help, you know, Jared Goff, you know, stretch the field. He gave him an athletic, uh, guy, athletic guy. So, to me, that makes too much sense. That makes too much sense. Um, to my bad, it was the 19th Super Bowl. I thought, uh, hold on. I think it might be the 19th Super Bowl. Oh, it's 2019. It was the 2018 season. So, yeah, he was on that team. So, yep, he was on that team. Uh, I think he got injured in the game. Yeah, I think he got injured in the game. But, yeah, he had eight catches, 120 yards. So, give, give Jerry Goff somebody. You can revamp this uh, receiving court just through trades. Give Jerry Goff somebody that can stretch the field. All of them, DJ Shark, bring him in. You can bring in the Cooks, James Washington, or you can bring in who else? I say uh, Michael Gallup. Gallup might be the most pricey, might be the more pricier one, you know. But like I said before, all of them great, uh, great pick. Also got Tim Pat. You also got Cortland Sutton that can that can also be traded too. So Andy Isabel could be on the trading block. So you got a ton of options if it was me. And also you got Terrell Crosby to give a starting right tackle, so you can flip Terrell Crosby too. So you got options. You got players to trade for players that they can come in and start. But if it was me, I'd probably go James Washington, DJ Shark. And those are probably the two I go to, and they're gonna probably end up starting for them. Tell you that right now. Let's see if it's in my Ross St. Brown work the inside of the hashes. But hey, let me know what you guys think. Think take the Detroit Lions Talk playlist out. Don't forget me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. All my social media subscription. If you want to advertise on channel, if you request chop it up. Want to make a financial donation? Cash App, CJ Good 313, Venmo, CJ Good 313, PayPal link. Appreciate the financial donations. Best way to donate, thumbs up, share, subscribe to the channel. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. Check out Detroit Lions Talk playlist. Appreciate the love and support. Peace.